Welcome to the Contrail product demo series. Today, we are showcasing Contrail's intercloud orchestration capabilities to facilitate hybrid cloud deployment. Hybrid cloud represents the next evolution in enterprise cloud architecture with promise of letting businesses enjoy the best of both worlds, the ultimate resource elasticity and flexibility of a public cloud and the security, control, and regulatory compliance of a private cloud. As ideal as solution as a hybrid cloud may sound, it can still face challenges from both sides. There are still formidable complexities to stitch together the disparate domains and the wide area networks together to securely and reliably connect public and private clouds in a hybrid cloud deployment. In addition, there potentially can be operational burden to manage two heterogeneous clouds with different architecture and processes. Juniper Contrail OpenStack Cloud has been uniquely designed to seamlessly scale across physical networks and perform intercloud federation. By extending AWS style API in Contrail OpenStack, we make managing the private and public clouds consistent, simplifying hybrid cloud to operations. Coupled with Juniper's virtualized security solution, Firefly Perimeter, also called VSRX, Contrail can dynamically spin up a virtual firewall service and establish an IPsec tunnel to a virtual private cloud in AWS to guarantee secure intercloud connection, in addition to using traditional VPN to connect to the clouds. In this demo, we are going to show you how quickly and easily you can get a hybrid cloud up and running between a private cloud orchestrated by Contrail OpenStack and a virtual private cloud in AWS. We will extend a virtual network in the private cloud to AWS VPC so that virtual machines can communicate seamlessly regardless of where they reside. In the Contrail Management Council, we first create three virtual networks, public for accessing the internet, IPsec Management VN for virtual service management, and IPsec Corporate VN as a private network in the private cloud with IP subnet 192.168.1.0/24. Now as we create a Contrail in-network service template that has left, right, and management interfaces. Once we have the service template, we can instantiate a service instance called IPsec VSRX instance with IPsec Management VN, IPsec Corporate VN, and Public as its management, left and right interfaces. The service instance becomes up and running almost instantly. We then use the OpenStack UI to launch a virtual machine within the IPsec Corporate VN for verification purposes. While the VM is being launched, we log on to the Firefly service instance to make sure that it can reach the internet by pinging 8.8.8.8. .8 Let's then establish a service chaining policy to direct all traffic from IPsec corporate VN to public network to go through my IPsec VSRX instance and activate that policy by associating it to both my corporate network and public network. We now switch gears to the AWS VPC web portal and create an Amazon VPC with private subnet only and hardware VPN access option. Setting the public facing interface address to my Firefly service instance to be the public VPN router IP address, IPsec corporate VN, as the prefix group for the private cloud side of the connection and 192.68.2.0/24 as the prefix for the public cloud side of the connection. My Amazon VPC is now successfully created, and I follow the instructions to download the configurations I need to apply to the VPN gateway on my private cloud side which is my IPsec VSRX instance. We need to do a bit more security configuration to update the Amazon VPC default security group 
to pass traffic to and from my IPsec corporate VN on the private cloud side. Also, for verification purposes, I'm going to spin up an Amazon Linux virtual instance called AWS Host inside that VPC that I've just created and associate it with the default security group that I have just updated so that once everything is set up, this virtual instance can talk to my virtual instance in my private cloud. The IP address in this instance is 192.168.2.154. Once the Amazon side of the configuration is done, I go back to my Firefly instance and apply the configuration demanded by the Amazon VPC connection to bring up the IPsec tunnels between my private cloud and public cloud and verify that the tunnels are up. At this point, I can verify the connection by issuing a ping from my corporate host to my Amazon VPC instance and the pings are going through. That concludes the Juniper Contrail OpenStack Hybrid Cloud Demo. Thank you so much for your interest.